The objective of the technical team at Hutchinson's is to produce the best objective agronomic advice for our agronomists to bring to you, the growers. We do that by doing hundreds of replicated trials and we work with Rothamsted and NIAB and ADAS and the John Innes Centre, the leading research organisations, as well as our suppliers. And as those solutions come closer to market and we're about to bring them to you on your farms, then we'll roll them out in regional technology centres. Now we have nine regional technology centres throughout the country all on different soil types to have growing conditions similar to yours, the growers. Now at those technology centres we have a focus this year on three particular things. The first one is the new varieties coming through and you can see we've got old seed rape but we've got cereals as well. Second point we're going to look at is crop establishment and looking at soil cultivation techniques and the fertiliser programmes that we encourage growers to use. And the third area is going to be disease control. Lots of uh, changes in there, lots of evolutions of, of disease resistance as you've, as you've seen. And the objective of these meetings is, is not for us to lecture you, but to, to go into the fields and talk to you and discuss with you and find the right solutions for you, the agronomists and, and growers, that can suit your growing habits and your growing practices for the 2015 growing season. We've got 28 varieties of wheat across nine demonstration sites across the UK. And in each of those sites, uh, the uh, varieties are split as uh, an untreated and a treated, uh, and that's complete field treatment. So each of those varieties receives a true local input in terms of disease and plant growth regulation and nutrition. In addition to that, we have um, a range of uh, plots uh, looking at um, different fungicide levels of, of treatment and also nutritional input uh, to, these, to these crops. Um, so we we'll try and relate this very much to a practical input on your farm. Bring us your problems, come and have a chat with us, look at the varieties in your local situation, and then we can discuss package that would help you increase your yields. This year we have new varieties in each of the main uh, sectors. So in the group one bread making sector, group two bread making sectors, group three soft milling sectors, and group four hard wheat making sectors. In addition to the new varieties, we'll be showing you existing varieties so you can get a clear comparison between the varieties you're growing now and varieties you may want to grow in the future. In addition to the varieties that have been through the recommended list system, we'll also have three exciting new varieties that may be of interest to you. We've been looking at the crop monitoring project here on this site for the last three years and uh, we're really excited about some of the data, uh, looking at uh, crop growth stages, uh, looking at soils, looking at the plant development and uh, really looking forward to sharing some of this data with you uh, when you come and visit us. Omnia is the Hutchinson's Precision Technology Service and uh, what we'll be dem demonstrating at our sites is our use of precision agronomy to add real benefit to what farmers are doing using variable seed rates for improved grass weed control and variable herbicides to use appropriate doses where they're necessary. I find the information we glean here invaluable in terms of my commercial um, growing of crops and also in terms of my agronomic advice. The trial plots are very interesting and very informative and usually give me a heads up of what to expect in terms of disease pressure and crop performance of the individual varieties. You'll be able to discuss your problems of royal seed rape establishment, getting the best out of new varieties and boy we've got some new varieties. There are over eight varieties new on the recommended list, there are nine candidates very confusing picture. So here's a golden opportunity for you to come and have a look at them in the field in full canopy, fully podded and look at what might just be best for you. No one problem can be solved with one solution so we hope that by joining us during June and early July we can make some real good decisions together about how to go forward. Come along with your agronomist, we'd be really pleased to see you.